Hello all, in today's lecture, we are going to watch about insect reproductive system, male. In insects, the male and female sexes are mostly separate. Sexual dimorphism is common among the insects, where the male and the female differ morphologically. For example, bees, mosquitoes and cockroaches. Gynandromorph an abnormal individual with secondary sexual character of both male and female example mutant drosophila and hermaprorite hermaprorite is nothing but the male and female reproductive organ or gonads are present in a single organism example cottony cushiony scale male reproductive system Morphologically, the male tract consists of a paired testis, each containing a series of testicular tubes or follicles in which the spermatozoa are stored or produced, which open separately into the sperm duct or vas deferens. This vas deferens expands posteriorly to form a sperm storage organ or seminal vesicle. Tubular paired accessory glands are formed as diverticula of the vas differentia. Sometimes the vas differentia themselves are glandular and fulfill the function of accessory glands. The paired vas differentia unite where lead to ejaculatory duct. Accessory glands are one to three pair associated with vas differentia or ejaculatory duct. Its function is its function is to produce seminal fluid and spermatophores, a sperm containing capsule. The number of testes follicles varies in different insects. The main function of reproductive system is the production and storage of spermatozoa. Four spermatozoa is produced from a single primordial germ cell which is called as spermatogonia. Testis, it is above or below the gut. The number of testis tubes or follicles varies. This example, Adiphaga coleoptera has one number of tubes in Orthoptera 100 and Cerambicidae 12 to 15 lobed. Vas deference and seminal vesicle. Vas deference, seminal small duct connect testis follicle to the vas deference is called vas afferents. Seminal vesicle is the dilation of vas deferens in all insects. In Hymenoptera and Nematocera and Diptera, seminal vesicle is the dilation of ejaculatory duct. Duplex and simplex. In Lepidoptera, the sperms or spermatozoa are stored in dilation of vas deferens and then in dilation of ejaculatory duct, which is called as simplex sorry duplex here the spermatozoa is stored both in vas deferens and ejaculatory duct but in simplex the sperm or spermatozoa is stored only in ejaculatory duct ejaculatory duct present in between 9th and 10th abdominal segment epidermal in origin hence lined with cuticle in dermaptera paired ejaculatory duct is present where one is vestigial. In Epimeroptera, a may fly, the ejaculatory duct is absent. At least a pair of muscle is present in the duct, except in aphis. Except aphis, all insects have a pair of muscles. Accessory glands, it secrete proteins which encapsule the spermatozoa. It is ectodermal in origin or mesodermal in origin. The difference were given in the tabular form. Heteroptera, both ectodermal and endodermal in origin. The number of accessory glands vary in different insects order. For example, Lepidoptera have one pair of accessory gland, Tenebrio have two pair, Locust have 15 pair. Grillus have 600 
number of accessory gland epimeroptera diptera and odonata were non distinct dumb cells in periplaneta the cockroach the american cockroach the muscle in the accessory glands are innervated by octopaminergic cells these cells are located in the midline of the ganglion their role is the secretion or production of octopamine in the cells they are dorsally located and paired and median cells hence called dum the dumb cells the spermatozoa it is 300 micrometer long greater than 1 micron in diameter head and tail region are same diameter cell membrane 10 nanometer thickness outside coating of glycoprotein is called glycocalyx fleece 13 nanometer thick in grasshopper it is 30 nanometer thick here you can visualize the drosophila spermatozoa which is 60 millimeter in length the lepidopteran sperm has a series of projection called lacinate nucleus cover the greater part of head in grasshopper it gives honeycomb appearance in lepidoptera there are two kind of sperm one is a pyrene and another one is u pyrene a pyrene is nothing but the normal spermatozoa where u pyrene that cannot affect fertilization has only micronuclei next one is sperm bundle Tysnura and some coleoptera, two sperms are twisted together, which is called as a bundle. In coquids, 32 to 64 sperm form a bundle. In orthoptera and ordinate, the sperm bundle are called spermatodesms. Don't forget to subscribe and click the bell icon and watch the female reproductive system.